Hello, my name is Aditi. I am a Technical Account Manager here at the AWS office in Boston. Today, I am going to show you how to distribute read requests across multiple Amazon Relational Database Service read replicas. Let's get started. To distribute read requests across multiple Amazon RDS read replica, you need to first find the DNS endpoint URLs for the read replica. Then you create an Amazon Route 53 hosted zone. And finally, you create the record. Let's see how this is done. After logging in to the AWS Management Console, navigate to the RDS Console. In the Navigation pane, choose Databases. Select the Amazon RDS instance with multiple read replicas. Note the DNS endpoint URLs for each read replica. Next, create a Route 53 hosted zone. Note, you can skip this step if you already have a hosted zone. Open the Route 53 console and choose Hosted Zones from the navigation pane. Choose Create Hosted Zone. Enter a domain name and comment. For type, choose the private hosted zone for the VPC that your read replicas are located in. Choosing a private hosted zone blocks access to the read replicas from external resources. Or leave type set as public. Note, you must own the domain that you specify in the hosted zone if you choose public. Choose Create. Now we will create the record. After the hosted zone is created, select it and then choose the option Create Record. Use the following attributes for the record. For record name, enter a name that you will use as the endpoint URL to access the read replicas. Set type to CNAME. In the value field, paste the DNS endpoint of the first read replica. For TTL value, set a value that is appropriate for your needs. This value determines how often each read replica receives requests. For routing policy, choose weighted. In the weight field, enter a value. Be sure to use the same value for each replica's record. It's a best practice to configure health check. For record ID, enter a name. After configuring the record, choose create. Repeat the steps to create a record for each additional read replica. Be sure that the records use the same name, the same value for time to live, TTL, and the same values for weight. This helps to distribute requests equally. You can add more read replicas to respond to more connections or high resource use without changing your application endpoint. You can also incorporate Route 53 health checks to be sure that Route 53 directs traffic away from unavailable read replicas. So now you know how to distribute read requests across multiple Amazon RDS read replicas. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.